So, I would like our relationship to grow. I believe that in the beginning. I hated, and I will be very honest with you, I hated the babysitting checkups you did. Understandable. I, I hated it. I literally hated it. But I understood it. It's not like it was not reasonable. I just couldn't stand it. I didn't tell you, but yesterday I robbed one of the Scots by accident. Hmm. I didn't know he Wait, was a Scot. I don't remember his name. Could be Angel, maybe. I don't know. I don't remember the name. I remember the voice and the face, but not the name. I told yeah, him I give him you? back his. Yeah, I, I, I was telling Barzini my name, so it is what it is. Hmm. I was very blunt with Barzini, so we'll see what happens. Talk to him today. If he wants to go up and back, no problem. No issue. Uh, Bishop got stabbed. What did you say? I got stabbed by the Scots. In the back. Wait, you said uh, I'm uh, confused. Diego maybe had his information wrong. He says that the Scots stabbed you. <laughs> that doesn't the sound Scots right. Did. What do you mean the Scots so, did? These fucks. So we, I come back from a headache. And I see these fucks standing around Diego. And then they're like, just, I don't know what they said to Diego, and then he no, sees no, a shotgun on my back. We had just have a friendly conversation at that point. Yeah, and then he sees a shotgun on my back, which was his shotgun, which uh, we apparently broke. So then he says, give me the shotgun, I put it down on the ground, and then he's like, oh. and then he takes it, so I, you know, I pull out my gun, I'm like, why the fuck did you take that? And then... He's like, chill out, chill out, and I was like, okay, I'm chilling out, and then he just, he goes behind me, and oh, I've chilled out, I'm just standing back, and then he throws a knife into my back. Well, what the fuck? He throws a knife to your back after getting the shotgun back? See. Si. Was this the same man that we took the shotgun from yesterday at the telegram? See. Si. I told them, doing this was not good. They, they basically said, uh... I don't give a shit. I said, you know, this is gonna be blood for blood. They said, bring it on. Ha! <laughs> okay, that's fine. Bring it on, eh? We scooped the area, right? They're having a meeting right now. Okay. Okay, I'll say, Dito. Everybody grab your horses. Where is Charles Scott? Right here, Pedro. Charles, what the fuck is going on, amigo? Come yeah. here. I would like to ask the same thing, honestly. We robbed people in Saint Denis. Your man was there. I did not recognize him. <laughs> and then I told him I'd give him shit back. Why would you guys go and fucking go? You guys could spread out as spread sp spread out as much as you want. My point is what? is that why would you go then and have your man stab my boy after taking the shotgun back? That's not honorable. Because your boy was talking shit. That's why. Amigo, if that happens, I will go to you directly and handle business. I guess so. But we also, let's be honest, Peter, we had an agreement saying that you guys don't rob in Lemoyne. Amigo, broke several I'm going to tell, tell you something. I'm going to tell you something. We are not under the Scots. We're not. No, we are not. Yeah, not. so that's not a thing. Listen, I do not do the holding an hand. agreement is an agreement. No, no, no. When we were in fucking the swamps, that was agreed upon. Because we cannot shit where we sleep. I agree with you there. That is common sense. We are not in the swamps anymore. Am I not correct? You have heard the rumors of where we are. Yeah, I know you are. Yeah. Charles, you are one of the few people that I liked, amigo. I did not like the fact that you interfered constantly in our affairs. But one of the few that I liked. What, like, what the, why do this? Why do this, amigo, when you know it's going to start a war? You saw me rob yesterday, right? And then you mm -hmm. saw me go and tell you I'll give you back your shit. I told you I that. I did. I know. I know. Why do but, this? Because as far as we're concerned, you guys shouldn't be causing trouble in the mine. One way or another. So what are you guys? You guys are law now? I mean, Charles, are you law? No, of course we're not. No, fuck we're not. So what are you, not. What are you doing, well, amigo? No, but the chances are, if but you're robbing people in Lemoyne, you're going to be robbing people that are friends of us. That's and then, you know what happens? We talk like adults, and we handle it. But why is your man lying then when we ask him about the shotgun? 
Yeah, you do why it. is he lying? Why, 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 do, why does he don't have the fucking balls to say yes, that was me? Well, let me ask you a question. When you start insulting like that, amigo, doesn't that start off shit when I'm talking and you're starting to insult? I have not I'm insulted you not once. I have not I'm cursed. You, I have not been disrespectful. I'm asking you a question. What is I'm it? I'm asking you a question. Why did he just... Why, why, why will he lie to us? Maybe he didn't know it was yours. That's the truth. <laughs> I'm just mean, saying. Okay. I, I, don't, I did not even recognize your man, Charles. I did not even recognize no, 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 no. him. This was an unprovoked situation. Jimmy knew. I knew who he was, and I apologized to him. It's not about the rubber. You got your weapon back. Stabbing him was mm -hmm. personal after that. Like I said, it's not about the rubber. It's about you causing trouble in the mine and this isn't the first time that it's been it doesn't now, matter i'm a bandito it, it's, guys no, I, I yeah, of course I, we, we understand that not. but as far as we were concerned this agreement still stood that's what yeah. we're trying to say you know what? if we had a, if Sorry. we had an agreement beforehand and you know we just let this these things slide then you're just gonna roll over us and you're gonna think that we do nothing about it so we have to do something about it to show you that we're not just gonna back down if you do something against us that we don't like we are gonna retaliate right we needed to show you that otherwise you would just think that we're pushovers i think that you can understand that pedro more than anyone else you wanted to make a example as far as we were concerned this you know agreement that we had still stood nobody ever told us now we live in new austin we don't need to have an agreement so you told, I mean, you told us that you still lived in Dakai, but you would travel to the Amatila from time to time. That's what I heard. Yes, you're you know, correct. And yeah, and that would mean that you're still citizens of Lemoyne, so to speak, right? And in our ears, our mind, it would mean that our agreement still stood. You know, and it's not because, no, we're not the law around here. Of course we're not. But we, of course, we have an interest in Lemoyne. We want to see profit and all that here. And we don't want to see innocent people hurt. That's just how it is. But no, we don't work with the law, or we are not the law. Of course not. There have been, but there it, have been, it's about there have been. the it's about the agreement that we made a long time ago. Okay, I can understand your logic in this. No, it's fine. It's fine. But you did this, right? I believe. Yeah, I did. Blood for blood, and the shotgun back is fair. That is, and look at me, no gun out in front of you guys. I know I could get shot like in two seconds. I think that's fair. I think that's yeah, fair, amigo. I, I don't think that's fair at all. If you understand you our logic... We've never hurt you! We've no, literally no. never shot you guys! It's the principle of you robbing ten people... Back up, amigo, thing. please. Please. Oh, I need to speak to him. How are you? Still gonna support your man after he threw a pack something back to me, right? And the fact... Just the fact that you're... Just, no, 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 listen. Just the fact that you're talking to me right now is pissing me off, so you better back off right now. Oh, Talking to me right now is pissing me off, so you better back off right now. Motherfucker. Fuck. Didn't work out for you well, did it, boys? Send you back to New Austin, you little cunts. Fuck it! Piece of shit, man. Go back to the Austin. What the fuck? Whoa. Oh, shoot, shoot.
<laughs> yep. Okay, okay. I've heard about it, I think. I think you, your name rings a bell. Okay. Miss Razor, I'm going to ask you a very uh, weird question here. And if you don't want to do it, that's all right. I'm just going to ask you straight up. That's the kind of man I am. But I'm going to need one of them alive. That's what I'm hoping for, to keep them alive. Yeah, and then I'm going to need them to take them, take them with me because they attack my rents without, you know, any real reason. So I want to know why. Okay. All right. So, if you um, if you don't mind, of course, I would like this guy over here. It's the guy I want. I don't give a shit about the others, but he's the guy I want. Can we make that deal? Uh, sure. Thank you. Good morning, Pedro. All right, I've got to have you to put your hands up. We're we're going for a little ride. What do you mean? Petro, Petro, Petro. I'll say I'm disappointed in you. Disappointed. I mean, one thing is, you know, why why do you want to attack shooting innocent people? I don't understand that one. Innocent people. I, I mean, uh, that, that, those people on that range that has nothing to do with us. It's farmers, innocent people. They're just workers. They don't even know what we do. Amigo, if they are with these scots, they are targets. I have a question for you. What, what do you want? <coughs> Big man. Mm, the other guy. Are you, are you left or right handed? Oh, oh, oh. Why does it matter? Because I'm gonna fucking take your finger off, you hear me? gonna do the dirty tricks like you do to fucking everyone. Amigo, if I had the ability to kill you right now, I would. And I would chop off your ear. But right now, I cannot do that, can I? So you want this fucking finger. Take it. <clears throat> yeah, right, man. Can you hold him? I guess it's time, huh? <sighs> Alright. Get it all off. You ready, Petro? <clears throat> Come on, do it. Now. <laughs> Holy shit! Alright, Pedro, come on! I guess that you're a brave man. Uh -huh. Respect to you, Pedro. Just, um. I'll have you know that this thing is, you know, instead of me shooting your people. I could have multiple times when while you were laying on the ground. I could have done all sorts of things to them. But I let them go. Because I don't want to talk to you. You know, next next time we are in this situation. I'll let I'll let everyone go. But I had to show you that I'm not afraid to do whatever you guys normally do. We have enough horses to allow Pedro to take one. Oh god, my foot! I'm oh, you can fucking run. <laughs> Fuck you, cabron. Love you too. Honor.